gonna go ahead and jog it out on the spot. And now high knees, get those knees up, land on the balls of your feet. Keep your arms going, arms and legs. Get that whole body moving. Try to spring off the balls of your feet. And now butt kicks, heels up to your butt. Get those heels all the way up. And now spread as fast as you can. Arms and legs as fast as you can go. 10 seconds spread. Five seconds faster if you can. And now high knees again. This time higher, this time faster than last time. Really get them up this time. Butt kicks again, heels all the way up. Try to get them all the way, all the way up to your butt. And sprint now, five second sprint, faster than last time. Okay, now jumping jacks. Now squat it out. Just body weight squats. You can add a jump if you want at the top, little hop if you want. And now side to side hops on the balls of your feet, side to side. Just some arm circles. Move the other way, opposite direction. All right. Okay, so you can grab a quick drink of water if you want. We're going to do core cardio and abs today. We're going to do the pyramid format. So, the pyramid format, we'll start with a 30 second interval, then a 40, 50, 60. Then we'll have a 90 second peak, and then everything we did on the way up, we'll do again on the way down in descending order. All right, so the first one we're gonna do is a fast feet football drill. We're gonna do two different moves with it. I'll show you. So you're gonna get up on the balls of your feet. Your knees are gonna be bent, okay? Knees are bent, and you're gonna move your feet as fast as you can, like that, okay? And when I say jumping jacks, you're gonna go into jumping jacks. And when I say fast feet, back into the fast feet. When I say down, you're going to go down and then right back up, almost like a burpee. So you're going to go down and right back up into that fast feet. All right, so it's fast feet until I call out something else, either jumping jacks or down and up. All right, ready? Knees bent on the balls of your feet. Ready, set, and go for it. Fast feet. Move those feet as fast as you can go. Stay low and move those feet. Now jumping jacks, jumping jacks. Fast feet, fast feet, move those feet. Quick, 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 quick. Jumping jacks. Fast feet, fast feet, move those feet. Five seconds, fast, 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 fast. Two, one, good job. Now we're gonna go on the ground. We're gonna go bicycles, three bicycles, four crunches. Okay, so you're gonna go like this. One, two, three, and then one, two, three, four. Okay, so three bicycles, four crunches. Ready, set, and go for it. So one, two, three, bicycle, and then keep that one knee in and do four crunches. And then three bicycles, four crunches,
This is the 42nd round. We're already 20 done. 20 to go. Last 10. Now you have last 10 seconds. Two, one. All right, good job. Back up on your feet. We do that fast feet with the jumping jacks. This time we're gonna add up and down, down and up. Ready? On the balls of your feet, sit and go for it. Fast feet, move those legs as quick as you can. Stay low and move fast. Now down and up, right away. Down and up, quick, quick, quick. And right back into that fast feet. Jumping jacks. Fast feet, fast feet. Jumping jacks. Fast feet, move those feet. Down, down and up as quick as you can. Back into that fast feet right away. Down. Fast feet, fast feet, jumping jacks. And fast feet to the end, fast feet. Two, one, good job. Back down to the ground, three bicycles, four crunches. One minute. All right, ready, set, and go for it. Three bicycles, four crunches. Keep that knee in after your bicycles. Do those four crunches. And then another three bicycles. The other knee should be in. So it should be alternating knees into your chest. Good job, you have 30 seconds left for these 30 seconds. Abs should be burning now, you should be filling those abs. Last 15, finish it up, try not to quit. Try to go this entire last 10 now, last 10 without quitting. Two, one, all right, good job. Next one, 90 second round. We're gonna do three level holds. So the three level holds, so leg holds, straight legs, just off the ground to begin, and then a little bit higher, and then a little bit more, then we'll go back down. Okay? Hold it at each one of those positions until I say, ready, set, and go for it. Legs just off the ground to begin. Legs are straight. And if you want to add a little bit more, get your shoulders up off the ground as well. And now a little bit higher, a little bit higher now. Not too high. This entire time, 45 degrees is the maximum height. Nobody at 90 degrees. And now a little bit higher, about 45. No higher than 45 though. And keep them straight, fight to keep those legs straight. The longer the lever, the harder this is. Now back to the middle, back to that middle position. Back to the bottom position. Back up to the middle, back up to that middle position. Fight now, should be shaking now. Back to the top. Back to the middle. Back to the bottom, hold it now, at the bottom. Two, one, all right, good job. Take your break, water break. And then we're gonna go back into the bicycles, the three bicycles and four crunches. Three bicycles, four crunches. We'll start off.
Bryce, you got about 30 seconds left on the brake. Remember, after the brake, we're gonna go down the pyramid, everything we just did in reverse order. So three bicycles, one, two, three, and then four crunches. One, two, three, four crunches. Three bicycles, four crunches for one minute. Ready, everybody down. Set, and go for it. One, two, three, bicycles, and then one, two, three, four, crunches. Keep that knee in for your crunches, then do another set of three bicycles, and the other knee in for your crunches. Push through, push through the pain. If it's burning, it's working. That's where you gotta push. Less than 30 seconds to go. Fifteen now, fifteen seconds. If you fell out, I want you to get back in. I want you to finish up. Just under ten seconds to go now. Two, one, all right, good job. Up on your feet, we're gonna do the fast feet, fast feet with the jumping jacks and the down and up. Remember when you go down, go down, and then pop it right back up. Ready, knees bent up on the balls of your feet. Sit and go for it. Move those feet, stay low, move fast. Move those legs. Jumping jacks. Fast feet, fast feet, let's go. Down, down and up, quick, quick, quick. Right back in those fast feet. Down again. Fast feet, fast feet, jumping jacks. Fast feet. Jumping jacks. Fast feet, five seconds to the end. Fast feet, fast feet. Two, one, good job. Down the ground, the bicycles, three bicycles, four crunches. We got one more each. Ready, sit, go. Three bicycles, four crunches. there 15 seconds ago and then we just have that last one 30 second interval coming up last five finish it finish this one two one all right good job back up on your feet fast feet jumping jacks down and up 30 seconds ready knees bent up on the balls of your feet sit Go, fast feet, right away, move up feet. Jumping jacks. Fast feet, fast feet. Down, down and up as quick as you can. Fast feet again, down. Fast feet, fast feet, jumping jacks. Fast feet. All done, take a break. All right, so the next round, I'll show you the 30 second exercise, the 30 and the 50. We're gonna go forward hops, just like in the warm up, the side to side hops, we're gonna move forward in a zigzag pattern. Okay, so feet are together, and you're just gonna go one, two, three, four, then back, one, two, three, four. Right, so forward and back, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. 
If you don't want to go backward, when you get to the end, just turn around and go front again. So you can go forward and backward, or you can go forward and turn around and go forward again. The more you bend your knees on this, the more it becomes a leg exercise. So if you have a slight bend, it's not going to burn the legs as much, so it just gets your heart rate going. Okay, so you decide how you want to do it. If you want to focus on legs, bend those knees a little bit. All right, either way, ready? Going four forward, four back, set, and go for it. So one, two, three, four, and then back, two, three, four, and constantly moving. If you don't have that much room, then just do it side to side on the spot the entire time. Good, it's only 30 seconds. Keep a slight bend in your knees, and if you want more leg work, really bend those knees. Two, one, all right, good job. Next one, we're gonna go down into a plank. One arm plank, one arm plank until I say switch. Okay, so on your hand or on your forearm, into a single arm plank. When I say switch, just switch it up, just like that. Just your hand moves, not your whole body. Okay, just the hand will move. All right, if you can't do one arm planks, I want you to do shoulder taps, just shoulder taps. All right, ready, sit, go for it. So just one arm down, one arm behind your back, and switch. Just move the arm, don't let your body sway. Switch. 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 All right, that's good. Back up on your feet. Do those side to side, side to side hops in the zigzag motion. If you don't have a lot of room or if you don't want to move forward and back, just do the hops on the spot, side to side on the spot. Either way, ready, sit. Go for it. So four forward and then four back. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Or you can do it stationary on the spot, just back and forth, back and forth. Make sure you're up on the balls of your feet. Good, looking good. <laughs> Flying. I see some, some of you working the legs with those big jumps. Knees are bent. That's going to hurt. 25 seconds to go. Good job, everyone. Everyone's moving as long as you're moving. If you need to modify, just a little step, step like that. 10 seconds, 10 seconds left. Two, one, all right. Down the ground, single arm planks. Remember, if you can't do the single arm plank, just have both arms down and do a little shoulder tap, quick shoulder taps. Either way, get down, get set, and go. One arm down, other arm behind your back. Keep it tight. Switch. And switch. Remember, don't let your body move. Keep your body still, keep it square to the ground, switch, switch, we got one more coming up, and switch, 10 seconds, hold it, Two, one, all right, good job. 90 second round, we're gonna do cross body double crunches. So cross body double crunch, or just a cross body crunch. So I'll show you the double crunch, and I'll show you the crunch. So double crunch, put your one foot on top of your knee like this, other foot is off the ground, opposite elbow, opposite hand behind your head, 
and you're gonna come up and across. Elbow across to that opposite side knee, like that, okay? Up and down, legs and arms, upper body together. If you can't do it like that, put your foot on the ground and just bring the upper body, just the elbow up and across. Okay, keep your legs where they are. By the way, we're only 45 seconds each side. All right, ready, set, and go for it. Up and across with the upper body and the lower body, or just rest your lower body and do the upper body portion. Job. Try to make a connection if you can, if you can get up there, your elbow right to your knee. Ten seconds on this side, then we're going to go right into the other side. All right, switch sides and go. As soon as you switch, you're going. seconds to go. Last 30 to go for these ones. You can't do the double crunch any longer. Just go into that regular cross body crunch. Without the legs, just the upper body portion. Two, one. All right, take your break. So we'll do everything we just did. We'll do it again in reverse order, and then we're all done. So the next round starts with that one arm plank, single arm plank. We're gonna go in 15 seconds. 15 seconds. Go single arm planks. Remember, if you can't do the single arm plank, I just want shoulder taps. Just in the plank, shoulder tap, shoulder tap. We're gonna go 10 seconds before we switch each time. All right, so down to the ground, one arm down, one arm behind your back. Ready, set, and go for it. Pull that body up, square up your hips. Try to be as square as possible to the ground. And switch. If you want to make this harder, you can bend your elbow and get closer to the ground. Come on, switch. Switch. Switch it. Good. Keep everything tight, everything square. Square to the ground. Switch it. Last one, 10 seconds. Last five. Hang on. Two, one. All right. Good job. Back up on your feet. And we're going side to side hops. Forward and back. Four forward, four back. Or if you want to, just side to side on the spot. By the way, ready, sit, go for it. Just a slight bend in the knees. Unless you want to work those legs more, then really bend your knees and go for power jumps instead of speed. Good job. As long as you're moving, as long as you're moving. If you need to modify just a little step, step like this, that's okay. Just keep your body moving, keep moving. 25 seconds, 25. Last 15, last 15, keep moving. 10 seconds, everybody in. If you fell out, get back in and finish it up. Two, one, all right, good job. Back to those single arm planks. 
So as I was saying in the last round, if you want to make this harder, you can come down closer to the ground and hold your body up and then back up. That's hard. All right, ready either way. One arm behind, one arm down. Sit and go for it. Good, remember to square up those hips so you're not tilted. And switch. Switch. And switch it. Last one, last 10 seconds. Then we just have one more interval. One, all right. Up on your feet, side to side hops, four forward, four back, or just on the spot if you just want to go on the spot, side to side. Ready, set, go. 30 seconds and we're all done. That's 10 seconds gone, all ready. Everyone's looking good, moving well. 15 seconds, keep moving, keep moving, last 10, hustle, 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 two, one, all right, all done, good job everyone.